space. I know you all have a space in your house, in your room, that nobody can touch. So there's usually a space where you reside, as well as a place where you might like to go, where you want to go when you want to either get away or sit by yourself or reflect. Um, those spaces are sacred spaces. Also where we're going and where people have been laid to rest are also sacred spaces. Almighty Creator, all those here, for all those who are present, for all those who come with us in our hearts, we want to think of them, the benefit for them, their health, their prosperity, and the benefit to our community so it grows and prospers. This I say, I share, I hope, Amen. You all can say Amen. Amen. I volunteered today to participate to help clean up this cemetery because it needs to be clean. I think it's very important like clean up because we want to show the respect and we want to respect our ancestors and people who have came before us and then we want other people in the future to respect us also when we pass on. I think it's important that students remember the legacy of those that was buried here because they're our ancestors and they, they really are the reason that we're here today so without them we wouldn't have the education that we have, the rights that we have. Listening to one of the McKinley Tech uh, students from from uh, I think 1960, yeah. 1957, yeah, that was my favorite part because I got to hear what it was like before, and we got to compare how it is now and how it was before. On McKinley, on McKinley, victory is ours. On McKinley, on McKinley, victory is our aim. Winners all will do, will make the call and raise our name to fame. Rock, rock, rock. We will rout them, we will something to sell them. <laughs> we will do on the fight on for victory and hold that high up. Rock, rock. These words are as prolific and relevant today as they were in the 1920s. Although the leaves of DC might be transitioning, the roof will never change. It is up to our generation to preserve them and make sure they are known. Please accept this bench where visitors and can sit, reflect, and pay respect for the men, women, and children that have died here and that are buried here. But above all, accept today's service and our future promise to uphold their legacies. This is wonderful. This will be a gift that will last in perpetuity, and it's something that, I mean, it's there. It's not a plant that will die. It is something that will be there. So to the McKinley, my, my alma mater, mm -hmm. my folks, my people, thank you so much. Thank you. Yay. Yay.